Oh, made it to a little opening it looks like. Hopefully there's no bears over here. Yeah, this does look pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Two seconds later. We have one on. But I relined my pole last night and I downgraded to 12 pound line, so I don't really wanna try to power my way through this, so. Oh yeah. All right, guys, we're going in. My phone's in there. Oh my God. Bro, this is my time. Oh yeah. Oh God. All right guys, caught a nice one. Back right now, <laughs> or I release him. <laughs> so, guys, time to get back out there. Fortunately, I didn't have a scale to weigh it because it was a pretty nice one, probably my best one of the year. But yeah, we're gonna keep on fishing. It's a lot of rain right now, so we're getting absolutely soaked. But you know, it's all right. If I catch another fish, it'll Make me forget about the rain. All right, guys, my cousin's on. He has one on, but it's stuck in the weeds once again. Like the earlier one and the one from yesterday. So glad I got these waders. Oh, I see him. He's literally hung in the weeds. All right, guys, I caught my second one. Just kidding. Is this your PB? No, I'm sorry. This is a good one for you. This is actually pretty good. Should I just throw? Yeah. Bro, he has got like some sharp stuff. <laughs> He's got teeth. Wait, same one? <laughs> Guys, so I was trying to get my rod out of some weeds and I broke the rod tip. This is a Guggen Black Series rod, so retail it's like $300. Man, that sucks. Let's see if this will still cast. I'm expecting less distance. But I mean, it still works. I'll work with it. Let's try to catch a fish on the broken rod, I guess. I don't know how the action is going to be if I get a fish, if it's going to bend a lot, or if it's just going to... I guess it's turned into a heavy rod now. Got another one, guys. That feels good. I said with every fish, but this one feels better than good. Alright, guys. 
so these waders have been proving to work pretty good oh my god these fish have very sharp teeth i don't know what that is i know it's a sign of what they eat but i'm not <laughs> educated enough on it but oh, here we go my first one was on a white spinnerbait a zinger white zinger this one's on a orange bumper but another nice one pretty another pretty nice one here is what i meant to say uh so we're gonna throw this one back out uh, as you can see i'm in the water that's a bank so we're gonna cast back out there spinnerbaits have been working pretty effective and it's honestly my favorite spring lure my favorite winter lure my favorite summer lure my favorite fall lure this is my favorite lure in general. That would have been way easier to say. Yeah, so that rod held up pretty well for being broken. I don't think it's affecting me that much, but I'm definitely gonna have to buy a new one because earlier my bait flew off because it ripped or it got cut by the broken part of the rod. So I'm, gonna, I'm definitely gonna have to spend a couple more dollars to get another rod. And when I mean a couple more dollars, I mean like a hundred, more than a hundred. So that sucks. It's also pretty cool that they have hot dogs out here ready for people to eat. I'm not that hungry right now, but you know, if I was hungry, I would definitely eat that. This spot looks so good casting over there, but I haven't had a fish from there yet. It just looks good casting parallel to the bank. So, we'll see. Oh, I do have one on. I just sat there like a dummy. What? How'd he get off? I could feel him pulling. Oh, I'm so dumb. I just sat there, I didn't even set the hook. And I was just saying how that's probably good. Dang it. I just had a fish come up and try to get it. I don't know if you can see that. that he's on. Oh, he came back for it. Oh, look at those weeds. Oh no. Nice. Nice one here. Alright guys. Oh man, he's ripping up my finger. Cut another one right now. On the actually it's a different spin rate. Actually I'll show you it after early soon because I don't want to keep him out the water too long. But yeah, nice little chunker. Oh man. Get out there man. Ooh. He ripped up my finger. I don't know if you can see that. I'm bleeding. See that I'm telling you they got sharp teeth. But, you know, it is what it is, it's worth it. Unless I get infected and die, then I'd probably not be too happy. But let me show you what I caught this third one on. I caught that third one on this, I don't even know what to call it. You can see it though. Oh my god, back to that cast. Oh no! Oh no! I had one on back to back casts, but I got off. Oh no, that's so heartbreaking. Come back. Ah, he's gone. He is gone. Oh man. That's where you gotta watch for your casting. All right, guys, I wasn't recording, but I was walking my way out. Get up here, man. You know. I guess we're gonna have to go in for this one again. Oh, come on, man. I say this always. This one does feel like ice. 
I don't know how well he's hurt. Oh, nice Ooh, that is a nice one. It's a football. Alright guys. Guys, look at that. Another chunk. Don't fin me, your last guy fin me. Alright, for not finning me, I'll throw you out there. Nice one, man. So happy. It's probably my best bass day ever. I've caught nine bass in one day, but they were all like a quarter the size of these ones, so. Nice one. 